What's happening, YouTube? Cue ball back at it with another TCG opening. Uh, today we have the Yu-Gi-Oh! Phantom Rage First Edition Booster Box. Uh, I'm very excited to be opening this as there are a few Starlight Rares I'm looking to pull. We have Hita the Fire Charmer, uh, Phantom Knights of Torn Scales, Divine Arsenal, and Tri Brigade. Um, very expensive, very rare card, so I'm hoping to get one out of here. Um, if you're looking to power up your deck at all, or you're looking to just add some cards to your collection, you can find these boxes at local hobby stores or card shops for about uh, $60, $70. So without further ado, let's get this cracked open. Okay, so we have our display box open and set up. I believe there are 24 packs in here, so we're going to crack the first one open and we'll see what we get. All right, so we have UA Man of the Match, uh, Awakening of the, of the Possessed Gagigobite, Banquet of Millions, Mutant Blast. Uh, oh, oh wow, starting off good. Wow, we got Alpha, the Master of Beasts, Secret Rare. Uh, I believe this is one of the more expensive cards in this set. I think this one's about 20, 30 bucks or so. Oh, awesome, we're gonna have to sleeve that up. Oh, so we have Tri Brigade Revolt. Uh, free Range Monsters, Infernity Wildcat, and Infernity Suppression. Alright, so we're going to start with the left side. Let's just open up all the packs on that side first. And we'll see what we get. Okay, so we have Mutant Cry, UA Man of the Match, Geonator Transverser, uh, Mutant Expansion, uh, Super Rare Dual Avatar Fist Yui, uh, pa Perry Alice, Empress of Blossoms, uh, Magical Broker, Jabbing Panda, and Infernity Suppression. Alright, next one. Alright, so you have Gluttonous, uh, Reptolphin Grethus, Arcana Reading, Raiders Unbreakable Mind, UA Locker Room, uh, super Rare Dual Avatar Feet Armored on Gyo. Uh, one or eight. The Phantom Knights of Stained Greaves. Awakening of the Possessed uh, Rasen Ryu. And Jack in the Hand. Uh, Virtual World Shell Jaja. Dual Avatar Compact. Um, Infernity Conjurer. Xyz Import. Super Rare Dogmatica Ashian. Uh, Infernity Paranoia. Infernity Wildcat, Dual Avatar Return, and Charge into a Dark World. Okay, so we have Dual Avatar, Defeating Evil, uh, Awaken of the Possess, Mutant GB88, Banquet of Millions, uh, Super Rare Gizmek Makami, The Ferocious Fanged Fortress, Dual Avatar Return, Cupid 4, uh, Infernity Paranoia, and Virtual World Gate, King Long. Next pack. So we have Gluttonous Reptolphin, Mahama the Fairy Dragon, Raid Raptor Heal Eagle, Virtual World ZCGG, uh, Super Rare Mutant Mist, Jack in the Hand, Awakening of the Possessed Ross and Ryu, uh, Phantom Knights, and we have Mutant Fusion. We have uh, Dogma Dogmaticism, uh, Mutant Cry, UA Man of the Match, Geonator Transverser. Uh, we have Virtual World Roshi, Lao Lao, Super Rare, Charge into a Dark World, Magical Broker, Tri Brigade Nerval, and Tri Brigade Standoff. So, Proofiness uh, the Tactical Trapper, UA Locker Room, Dogmaticism. <laughs> Uh, Hinazumi Hanabi, Super Rare uh, UA Hyper Stadium, Charge into a Dark World, Mutant Clash, uh, Virtual World Kirin Lili, and Tri Brigade Nerval. And next pack. I'm going to call it, you guys. I'm going to put my money on the Tri Brigade Starlight Rare. Alright, Mutant Expansion. Uh, Virtual World Shell Jaja, Dual Avatar Compact, Infernity Conjurer, uh, Infernoble Knight, Captain Oliver, looks like a super rare, cool. 
uh, Mutant Fusion, Rookie for Hire, Jack in the Hand, and UA Player Manager. Okay, Raid Raptor, Heal Eagle. Uh, we have Tri Brigade Oath, Awakening of the Possessed, Mutant Blast. Uh, we have Brygrand Ultra Rare, Brygrand the Glory Dragon. Actually, looks really cool. Uh, we have Penguin Brave. UA Player Manager, Virtual World Gate Sing Long, and Tri Brigade Rugal the Silver Sheller. Alright, so we're almost done with the left side. So you got Xyz Import, uh, Gluttonous Reptolphin, uh, Mahama the Fairy Dragon, Raid Raptor, uh, Virtual World Dragon Long Long, Super Rare, Tri Brigade, uh, Virtual World, Mutant Clash, and one or eight. I also forgot to mention, um, one of the hollows in this set is actually Armatile, the Chaos Phantom. Uh, for those who are unfamiliar with that card, that is actually a fusion monster of the three sacred beasts from uh, Yu-Gi-Oh! GX. So that's another one I am looking forward to pulling out of here, if we can get it. Uh, so you have Perialis and Tri Brigade Revolt. Alright, so now we're moving on to the right side. Got half the box done, so will we pull the Starlight Rare? Let's find out. So you got Virtual World, uh, Profanese, Dogma, UA Locker Room. Uh, oh, here we go. Mutant Ultimus. Uh, yeah, Ultimus. Uh, Secret Rare. Very cool. Our second Secret Rare out of the box. Awesome. Look at that. Very, very cool. Uh, Awakening of the Possessed, Cupid 4, Tri Brigade, and Tri Brigade Standoff. And if we could just pull the Armatile and or a Starlight Rare, that would only complete the opening. Whereas Simply Unlucky would say would make it godly. Big fan of his. <laughs> Alright, Mutant Cry. Uh, we have a super rare prank kids meow meow mew moo I don't know <laughs> free range monsters infernity uh, infernity suppression and we got one or eight okay so you got uh, Hinazumi raid raptor tri brigade awakening of the possessed uh, super rare virtual world beast uh, juju. You got Phantom Knights, Rookie for Hire, Free Range, and Virtual World Gate. Next pack. I don't even know how many packs we have left. I'd say we have at least 10 to open. Okay, so you got Mahama, Raid Raptor, Tri Brigade, Infernity. Oh, what do we got here? An Ultra Rare Virtual World Phoenix Fan Fan. Very cool looking card. Man, some, some of these cards just look so cool. Look at that. Looks like something you'd see out of maybe like Mega Man or Gundam or something. And then Dual Avatar Return. Hunting down that Starlight Rare, guys. Let's see if we can get one. I believe that's a rarity that only came out fairly recently. Um, I don't remember offhand what set it debuted in. But I know that and uh, Collector's Rares from Toon Chaos are very sought after right now. They're very, very beautiful rarities, too. Uh, I can understand the hype. Okay, so you got Hinazumi, uh, Prufanese, Prufaness, uh, Raider's Unbreakable Mind, Gluttonous Reptolphin. Uh, Perfect Sync, A Yun, uh, Super Rare, and then Cupid, Infernity, Virtual World, and Charge into a Dark World. Come on, Armatile or a Starlight Rare? Let's see if we can get it. Okay, Mutant. We got Super Rare, Infernity, Doom, Archfiend. Pretty cool name. Infernity. Inferny Wildcat, Dual Avatar, and Charge into a Dark World. I know Pendulums and Link Monsters pretty much run the game now, but it is still cool to see 
XCs and synchro monsters still on still on the board. I was playing synchros and XCs a lot when they came out uh, years ago. I think it was 2013 or 2014 they debuted. So you got dual avatar, uh, virtual world shell. You got virtual world gate. Uh, that's a super rare. Magical Broker, Tri-Brigade, Tri-Brigade Standoff, and Mutant Fusion. Okay, you got Mutant Cry, uh, Mahama, Raid Raptor, Tri-Brigade, Conductor of Nephthys, uh, Super Rare, pretty cool. Jack in the Hand, uh, Awakening of the Possessed, The Phantom Knights, and Charge into a Dark World. Okay, uh, Geonator, uh, UA Libero Spiker, uh, UA Man of the Match, Awakening of the Possessed, uh, Raider's Wing, it looks like, oh, it's an Ultra Rare, cool. You got Rookie for Hire, Jack in the Hand, UA Player, and Tri Brigade. Two more packs, including this one. Can we get Starlight Rare? Let's see. Okay, Infernity, you got Hinazumi, uh, Profiness, Raider's Unbreakable Mind, uh, Joyous Melfist, that's a super rare. You got Mutant Fusion, Mutant Clash, Virtual World, and Tri Brigade. Alright, last pack. Okay, so Banquet of Millions, Mutant Blast. Gluttonous Reptolphin, Arcana Reading, uh, Super Rare Mutant Beast, or is that an Ultra? No, it's a Super. Uh, Virtual World Kirin, Mutant Clash, 1 or 8, and Awakening of the Possessed. Alright, so there you have it. That is the Phantom Rage First Edition Booster Box opening. Um, as I said, if you're interested in picking that up, uh, you can find that at local hobby stores or card shops for about 60 70 dollars uh definitely recommend it there's a lot of pretty sweet cards in here um so that's about it guys thank you for watching and um i'll talk to you soon